just don't know what to do anymore. Like, shouldn't be like this, you know? Been holding this in for a really long time now. And I am think I'm ready to maybe do something about it, you know? It's a sign. It's the airplane right above us right now. But, yeah, I mean, just the, the sense of being trapped. And just, I don't know, just, it's not fair. It's not fair. Can you hear me okay? Hopefully you can hear me okay. What's up, Kyle? How you doing, bud? But I think, yeah, I think we should definitely do something about this. Because it's just not right. It's not right. If you don't know what I'm talking about, talk about my freaking animals, okay? Talk about my freaking animals. They're way back there. I have nine acres of land here, and I've never let them roam around these nine acres. They're kind of stuck back there in, I mean, I don't know, maybe two acres, which isn't so bad after all. But, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let them go in here in a second. And you're more than welcome to see how happy they're, hopefully they're happy. Hopefully they'll come back. Uh, what if I can't get them back in there? I don't know. This could be a horrible idea. But we're going to get to watch what happens. What's up, Chelsea? What's up, David? Haven't gone live here in a long while. It's been, yeah, I don't even remember how long it's been. But a lot of you have been asking about my dog, Cookie. Cookie's been doing okay. She's got her good days and bad days. But mostly good days lately. I don't know. I think maybe whatever medicine Doc gave us seems to be working. I mean, I don't, Cookie's like a cockroach. Nothing can kill her, man. Like, not even a seizure or a stroke. Like, she's still kicking. So, yeah, just an update on my cookie. What's up, Ride? What's up, Time Traveler Jody? What's up, Outside? Rebecca, how you doing? So, the other day, my chickens, because I did a, a vlog the other day. I haven't vlogged in the last day or two because it has been super windy to the point where if I were to try to vlog outside here at the Safe Haven Ranch, it would be completely unusable footage, even with my little wind muff here. Like, it just would. I'm so dirty. Like, oh my gosh, like, yeah, farm life isn't um, what I thought it would be. I'm always looking busted. I got a, like a crazy beard, just always busy, you know, but uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's been, it's been very windy here. In fact, it was so windy. Let me show you this here. I kind of feel bad for my boy, Boston, because his basketball hoop got destroyed by the wind. Look at that. And it's, yeah, it's actually destroyed. But anyways. We haven't been getting a whole lot of rain here in this part of Florida, but in case we did, I went ahead and put my chickens in here. And this is where they're at. Hey, thank you, James. Appreciate that. The 10 pounds. But hey, let's let's see what's up to them real quick. They're growing quite a bit. Oh, what the heck is going on here? Look at this one on top of its feeder. Look how big they are. Like some of them are already getting feathers, especially this one. Hi, baby. How you doing? Oh, look at you flying. Hi. You want to see them go really crazy? Watch this. I've been giving them like some mealworms. This is actually a lot of fun. Hi guys. Hi guys. Who wants the mealworm? Who wants the mealworms? So one of them will grab a mealworm and then like start running because everybody start chasing them. Here, I'll just put some right there. I'm not going to hurt you. Here, there's some mealworms for you. But look at these guys, aren't they cute? They are so cute. <laughs> What's up, Alexandra? Hey, Gregory. What's up, Angela? And thank you, Donna, for your prayers for Cookie. But it's always a good sign. Um, I did want to give an update, too. On my last vlog, we had a little, little chicky that arrived kind of sick. And after evaluating some of that vlog, uh, I noticed that she didn't look good from the start and yeah we we lost her so I'm sorry I know a lot of you were like rooting for her but that's why some of these online like chicken places where they they they'll, they send you chickens in the mail they send you a couple extra and we got two extra so originally I ordered 25 chickens ended up with 26 or 27 um, and then I had one pass away so that's not that bad because I've heard where, you know, people lose like five of them. I mean, they're coming in the mail. So you just never know. But yeah, huge shout out to the 
think it was called i forgot the name of the hatchery place but hey thank you for your your dono appreciate that can you hear my goats it was uh from hardpoint official thank you hope all is well too what's up martha lopez uh hey what's up merida hey so i wanted to also do a quick update i am no longer on social media i haven't been on social media probably in the last week or so so i know that there's uh several of you that i talk to like online and stuff and I just just wanted to put that out there. I'm, I'm no longer like I deleted my Twitter. I didn't officially delete it, but I deleted it off my phone just because there's a lot that I'm seeing, like just people putting each other down. I mean, it's just social media in general. It has nothing to do with like communities. Uh, I think it's just it's just people like people are just not the friendliest online. And before we get started and I do what I do here, I just want you to maybe just realize, because sometimes maybe we can ourselves as humans, if we were to put these thoughts into action, maybe it will help. So we're not putting each other down and stuff instead of building each other up. That's my motto. I like to build people up instead of putting people down. So if, uh, before you post something on social media, before, I mean, even if it might sound, because sometimes people might take things the wrong way, but you know, you should ask yourself if the person was right here in front of me and I were to say what I'm going to say to them online, would they be offended? That's something you have to ask yourself. So, yeah, I just I got kind of tired of just seeing just the whirlwind of like just people in, in general, just being mean to each other and just entitled people in general. And I'm like, you know what? Like, it's so much easier for me because I'm an emotional guy. I'm an emotional guy. You've seen it on my vlogs before. And I sometimes can get involved and I'll see somebody being mean to somebody. And, you know, I want to do something about it or, uh, you know, somebody, I don't really care so much people being mean to me. I'm used to being people being mean to me, but I'm used to people being nice to me. And I try to try to focus on that, you know. But anyways, just wanted to, you know, in a nutshell, tell you why I'm not on social media and too much drama and it's so much easier so much better for me to be focused when i'm not involved in social media and, and seeing people put each other down and um yeah if you're on social media i mean we should have a social media that's just about positivity just about building each other up and like the moment you're mean to somebody you're done you know what i mean like there's just like yeah i don't think there's anything like that exists no youtube is no all right I, some people are asking here in the comments what about you i'm not i'm not gonna stop making videos on youtube let's get that straight okay because i did put a post on a community post and they were like oh well it's nice knowing you omar and no i like social media what i mean about social media is like instagram twitter and there's just social media and i mean i guess youtube is considered social media but it's not to me like it's just a place where you go to escape and watch videos and stuff like that. I mean, this is probably the best interaction you're going to get with me being on a live stream. So but as far as like personally talking to people and just interacting with people on on social posts, I probably won't be doing a whole lot of that on my Twitter or Instagram. So, uh, hey, what's up, Pam? What's up, Alyssa? But hey, let's do this. OK, because I did promise you that. Ugh. I'll tell you what, for the very first time ever, and uh, by the way, that's working out really great. I put my chickens in there just so then, just in case it rains and we could kind of lock them up at night. Weather's been pretty nice out. But yeah, for the first time ever, I cut the grass. Look at my grass, like it's so nice, right? Let me know here in the comments how long you think it took me to cut the grass out here. I did use a riding mower. I have a John Deary riding more and it worked pretty good but uh, yeah let me know in the comments how long you think it took me i have about nine acres yeah pretty close yeah two hours one hour three hours four hours. man a lot of you were real close okay mary here's the closest and, hey thank you for the thank you for the super chats guys sorry the comments are flying i didn't get to see some of those so exactly three hours it took me to cut all this Mind you, I did not go all the way back there in that paddock where the animals are because they didn't really need it. I think they do a pretty good job of, oh my God, look at this. This is the cutest thing. They know I'm coming. Look at them. They're running, running towards us. There goes Macy, Gracie, Dak. <laughs> Hi guys. Look at them. 
All right, I'm gonna let these guys free. And oh my gosh, look at them. They're all coming. <laughs> they, just, they just know daddy's coming. Hi, Macy girl. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Did you guys miss me? Did you guys miss me? It's only been a couple hours. Hi. How you doing? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. How you doing, Daki boy? Come on, guys. I'm going to let you go free. You let me know how you like it. All right, this should be interesting. All right, here they go. Uh, it's been a little different out here, too. I moved my chicken coop from over there. That's why it looks a little different. We moved it over there, and I got an additional chicken coop. So that's where we're going to be putting the chickens and the ducks in the future. What's up, Kyle? What's up, Angela? Uh, what's up, Lily? How you doing, baby? All right, you guys want to go free? Hi, Tom. Oh, all right, if I could only undo this. All right. You guys are free to go. I know you always wanted to do this. Hi, Miss Piggy. Look at Miss Piggy. Look how big she is. All right, you got to let me open this gate, though. Hey, Lamar. All right. Go ahead. Go free, guys. Go free. You guys can go. You guys can go. But you got to come back, though. All right? You going to come back? Hopefully, they come back. I don't know if they're going to come back. Hi, Dixie. Hi, Tommy boy. Hi, Louise. Hi, Rena. Rena's gone. Just don't chew on my hose, okay? Water hose, that is. Oh, the dogs are gone. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, I forgot to close the chickens. Dogs could probably play with the chickens. I'm not gonna get you guys. You guys stay here, okay? Oh my gosh. Silly me. Okay. All right. Hopefully the dogs don't eat my chickens. This is bad. Oh. Dak, Gracie, where are you going? One thing about great Pyrenees dogs, they don't listen very well, especially when they're puppies. Hi guys, come here. You want a treat? You want a treat? No, 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 don't go that way. Don't go that way. No, 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 no. Oh, thank God, didn't go that way. Oh, okay. This could have been bad. Just trying to protect my chickens here. Try to protect my flock. Oh, Whew. that was fun. Mm. Hi, Missy. Uh, how you doing, baby? <laughs> okay, you saying hi? Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Wow. Sorry about that. Oh, I should have thought of that. You know. In the back of my mind, I said, I got to close that. That's why I started off. Actually, I started out on that one, but I got distracted. How is Cookie doing? Um, Cookie's doing pretty good. She's doing really good. I was going to let her out here, but gosh, I'm out of breath. Um, my llamas don't like dogs very much. And they're naturally, what's the word? Enemies with dogs. Now, I did a good job kind of introducing my great Pyrenees puppies around them, and they kind of adopted them as their flock. But other dogs, like my dog Luna, I brought her out here a couple times, and my llama Dixie wanted to attack her, which is good. I mean, it's not good, but it's good if a wild dog or a coyote, a wolf, whatever, comes out and tries to get into my paddock area because they, they'll get attacked by the llamas. That's why you get llamas, they protect your, your flock. I do have the front of my gate locked up too. So they have this entire, like look at this. Like she's just loving this super green grass right now. Does that taste good? I'm so tempted. I don't know, maybe if this video gets like a thousand likes, I'll get down there with Macy and eat some grass with her. But uh, I don't know, maybe, uh, maybe that'd be kind of gross. Maybe not, maybe I shouldn't do that. What's up Luna? Hey Linda. Chantel, thank you so much for being a member and thank you for that little shout there. Uh, man, the comments are crazy here, man. Thank you guys for all the love. Hey, Omar, gosh, let me click on this. There we go. Dang it. All right. Come on. Try to figure this out here. 
shoot. Okay. I couldn't read that comment. Sorry. It was from Chantel. It was something about cookie. <laughs> uh, okay, there. The Safe Haven Ranch is... Oh, I lost it again. Dang. It's really hard to read comments here. What's up, Kelsey? Hey, Laura. Uh, thank you, Deborah. Big love from London. Hey, look at the animals. Look how much fun they're having. Just don't eat my well wires. Hi, Mona. I think they're doing pretty good. There goes the goats and our baby cow, Rena. There's the llamas. I think they're really liking this grass here. Does that taste good, Mona? I think it does taste good. What up, Glenny boy? Al Ann Alden said, me and my husband went to the... Gosh, I can't read these. Went to the SPCA back in... Oh, gosh. Named her... Oh, my gosh. Named... Wait, they went to SPCA back in... Oh, my God. I'm sorry. I cannot read these comments. <laughs> it's crazy. I'm so sorry. Uh, you know, maybe I can put it on slow mode. Let me see if I can do that. Um... Oh, wow, this is cool. What is this? You get effects on here? What? It could be a black and white. That's so cool. Look how cool my tattoos look in black and white. Hey, maybe I should do this arm just black. And yeah, black and gray or whatever. Okay, let me go back. No filter. Uh, what's good? What's good? What's good? Vodka Vam. What are you doing, Macy? All right, yeah, some, like, sometimes when you comment, like I try to scroll back up, but then I can't. So... Yeah, my bad. I'll try to read these comments as, as I go. My apologies. Let me see if I could put it on slow mode. Can I do slow mode? I can't do slow mode. So I am doing this from my iPhone. Um, okay. Hey, thanks. I had a nicer hat on earlier today. And hey, thank you, Lauren. We love you, bro. We talked to, uh, that's all I got. I'm sorry, but hey, thank you so much for, thank you for that. Barbara, I did give an update a couple minutes ago about the baby chick. She did not make it. And I feel really bad about that. It's really nothing we could do. We tried everything we possibly could. I think, uh, I think Tiffany even tried to give her CPR. I'm not 100% sure, but I think so. Hey, MD Paranormal. Uh, what is this? Ooh, that looks cool. Glow? That glows? Oh, look at this. It looks like vintage. Oh, I'm gonna keep that. That looks fresh. Looks like a music video. What's up, Ethel? And, hey, thank you. Oh, you put on slow mode. Let me see. Oh, no. Tiffany said about CPR. Uh, remove. Oh, so Tiff, since I made you a, a like a managing mod can you put it on slow mode because i can't do it hey robin what's up <sighs> ghost apps you're using my glitchy said something about ghost apps i do have if you go to like my recent videos hey thank you belinda if you go to my recent videos on like youtube like on omar gosh tv not on this channel but omar gosh tv you'll be able to see any ghost apps that i use i don't use them all the time but sometimes when i do use them but I put them in every video. So you have to go to the description to see that. Necrophonic happens to be one of my favorites. Dude, Miss Piggy, like I don't care what anybody says. She is so damn cute. Just, wait, what the heck? Oh no. Uh, I just heard Dak like crying. I think, what happened? Was that you, Gracie? Oh, it was Gracie. Okay, these guys look alike from far away. Did you get lost in there? I hope you didn't step on a nail or something. It's no nails. No nails in there. They're doing a drywall now. Still taking a while. People will come work and then they won't work. No work today. Hopefully we're in there by the summertime. It was, I mean, it's nice living in a camper. Like our camper is really nice. But I miss living in a house. Miss having a closet. Miss having like storage space. Even though we have we have some storage here. Hi, baby. Come here. Come here, baby. Come here. 
See how they don't listen? They don't listen, especially when they're out in the open like this. <sighs> Do you like to cook all, wait, what? Do you like to cook all you love food, right? I don't know, a little, little something said that. Um, I do like to cook when I get the chance. Hey, what's up, Tiffany? What's up, Lauren? Thank you for becoming a member. Yeah, and thank you for the the super chat a little bit earlier. Belinda, good evening. Hope everyone's well, and I love the way your farm is coming along. Hey, thank you. It's come along pretty good. Neighbors on, there's four-wheeler right now, so that's what that noise is. I don't know if you can hear. Hey, by the way, do you like how my microphone sounds? Because I'm not using my... I can't see it go. Okay. I guess Tiffany did put it on slow mode, but it's really not that much slower. But do you like the way this sounds better than like, you know, if I was just using the, cause uh, I think it sounds better. All right, sounds good. Okay. Cause you know what's cool about it is I could like walk over here and you could still hear me clearly. Okay. <sighs> Sounds good. All right, that's what's up. Mike is good. I am so happy seeing these guys. Like, like they're just having so much fun. Like I let them. I let them go. I let you guys go. You're done. Look, Miss Pig, Miss Piggy, so biggy. Well, yesterday I was cutting the grass. A little baby bunny, about that big. It was so little. It was cute. It looked like maybe two days old. Comes running underneath. Well, it came out of one of these little sheds here. And I had to stop the tractor right away because I didn't want to run him over. When he came out, I hurried up and got Tiff. I'm like, Tiff, you have to see this. She like, she was able to even like, he was so friendly. But uh, she thought she, he was so, he or she, she was so cute. He ended up running underneath the shed and she brought him like some, <laughs> she brought him some fruits and he ate the fruits. So look, Lamar is having a ball. Where's he at? He was just laying in the grass doing like some dirt baths. And there goes Tom Brady over there running. He's about to get neutered next week. Yep. He's already uh, trying to mount my girls. And I ain't trying to have any baby goats. Not right now, at least. Hey, Lamar, are you having a good time? But anyways, here's a safe haven ranch. Yes, I like the mic. Cool, cool, cool. Yep, that's Tom Brady. What's up, Sandra? Miss... Uh, Miss... Thing for okay, I think it's just Miss Thing. Thank you for the, thank you for the super chat. It says missed you guys, and that's all I saw. I wasn't able to click on that. Sorry. Uh, anywho, can y'all hear that four wheeler? Like, or is it? You know, it's, it's not too loud. I, I don't care. But just let me know. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 No. Yeah. Okay. Ah, <sighs> but yeah. Um. I know that there's a lot of you are, uh... okay, it's not too loud, all right, dope, but uh, a lot of you are just like loving farm life in general, or maybe it's like some of y'all's dream, it's always been a dream of mine, especially when I got a little bit of a glimpse, a little bit of a, a hint of farm life when I had chickens years ago, and, but having, oh my God, what is this, what is this guy doing, hey, what is that, it just chew on everything. But uh, chickens is a different story. It's, it's pretty easy to take care of chickens. If you're wanting to get into like farm life. <laughs> but these guys right here. <laughs> bah! Bah! They're on a whole different level of farm life. And I see that. Yeah. Oh, Tom feels left out. He's coming. Hi, guys. What are you doing? <laughs> Anywho. Uh, yeah, I don't know if this dream of mine is really a dream or if it's more of a nightmare. Oh, yeah, I'm just kidding. It's fun. It is fun having this many animals. But if you're already a pretty busy person, which I'm a pretty busy person already, I don't really sleep much. It's literally all day long i mean like between feeding them i mean i'm sure some of that's going to get a little bit better with time because at nighttime even in the mornings like we have to let them out we have to make sure they're like in an enclosure because they're 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 babies and i, I don't know like even though i have guard dogs 
the guard dogs aren't yet guard dogs. They're still puppies. They're getting big. They're, oh my God. Like, what are they chewing on? Like, what, what is this? Hey, Boston. Hey, if you're looking for this hat, Gracie has it in her mouth. That's what you get for leaving your hat out here. Like, they're just going to find shit to chew on. But yeah, they're still puppies. So I can't really count on them to, <laughs> to do any garden right now. Even though they're good watchdogs so far. They're, they're doing, they're doing, they're doing pretty good. Yeah, very playful. But it's a lot of work having a farm. It really is. But it's fun. It is fun. If, uh, if you have nothing to do and you want something to do, get some animals like this. Because it'll give you something to do, okay? I mean, that's if you're a good pet owner. I mean, I'm a good pet owner. Like, I mean, we got some big animals here. These cows, cows are no joke. They take ginormous number twos, okay? They take big ones. And if you could imagine when your St. Bernard goes number two in your yard, what do you do to it? You got to probably pick it up. You can't leave it on the golf course. So, hey, how you doing? Dak, you're getting so, you're getting so cute. I mean, you're already cute, but you're getting, look how big he is. Like, he's just a big boy. You're starting to look like Gracie now. You have, like, these gray ears. How you doing? Oh. So, I have to dispose of their, you know, their stuff. If not, it's going to accumulate, and it's going to be bad. It can cause parasite problems, you know, so you got to be careful with stuff like that. Uh, Tyler, thank you so much from Scotland. That's my boy right there. I have a terrible Scottish accent, by the way. Uh, tech girl and Dava. I grew up in a farming community. Love the country life. So, so much more healthy. I tell you what, you're right about that. And thank you for your, your super chat. When you are on a farm, thank you, Tyler, for the super chat. You do get plenty of exercise. Yesterday, I have a, a Fitbit. And I don't know if some of you guys track like your steps for the day. Hi, baby. Come here. Come here, come here, buddy. Come here. Oh, you scared? But <laughs> yesterday, after like cutting the grass, spending the whole day like just doing outside stuff, I had 25,000 steps for the day. That is, I, I don't think I've ever had. I mean, even on a super busy night where I'm filming and I'm doing a lot of running around at a location like, you know, let's say like Waverly Hills. I might track like 14,000 steps, which is a lot. I mean, 10,000, even 5,000 steps is a lot. But 25,000 steps, like that's definitely like, yeah, calorie deficit, 100%. So it's uh, just to give you an idea, it's a lot of work being on a farm, but it's fun. I wouldn't trade it for the world. But yeah, that's what these guys are doing. It's gonna, you know, I'm going to try to maybe get them back in. I'm going to try to lure them back in. What are you doing over there? What are you guys doing? Hey, you're not allowed over there. They just like climbing on stuff. Mona, whatever you do, do not go number two over there because mommy will kill me. Hi, Mona. You want to move for me? I mean, I could just have these guys cut the grass. They're doing a pretty good job. Hi. Where are you going? Where are you going? There goes Dixie. They're having a great time. <laughs> Hi, baby. Oh, what you eating? All right. So, uh, it's kind of gross. Oh, no. Why? No, don't eat that. Yeah, don't eat that. I did say when I got a thousand likes that I'd eat some grass. So, uh, all right. Hey, Doc, you didn't go pee pee right here, right? Okay. Okay. You want to eat some grass with me? Huh. Right. Okay, gotta move your foot. Huh. Oh. Why do y'all taste good? Why do y'all. Why? Why do you think that tastes good? That does not taste good at all. Ugh. Hey, y'all want to see how my house come along? They already 
started doing like mudding in the drywall. It's a little dark in there. But uh, let's have a look. What do you say? Yeah, yummy. Look at this mess. Lots of drywall on the floor. Well, drywall mud, but yeah, they already started mudding in here. I did find a mess up. I have like can lights here. See, there's usually like four in the corner and they covered up my one can light over there. See, there's supposed to be one right there and then one right there. So there's a can light under there that they didn't cut the hole for. So I may have to do that on my own. I did tell the driver, what are you doing in here? Hey, Dak, you're not allowed in here. Come on, let's go, come on, let's go. Dak, 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 come on, let's go. Come on, come on, buddy, come on, come on. Let's go out, let's go out here, come on, buddy. Come on, Dacky boy, come on. These dogs are very independent, so they're not the best listeners. I mean, they'll listen, but when they want to listen. Okay. Whoa. Look, my neighbor's horse is like running laps. He's going crazy. That's Hamlet over there, by the way. Hey, thank you, neighbor, for the music. Oh my gosh. Look at this guy. He's having a good time. I think they're liking being outside. I think they're liking it a lot well I mean they're already outside but so look this is really good see how my goats follow the llamas around they know that the llamas are gonna protect them so they be rolling with the llama well I know Dixie 100% she'll protect them if she needs to because she's tried to attack Luna before I mean you know I won't let her of course gotta show this girl how to be an attack llama one day hi baby Safe Haven Ranch. This is the face of the Safe Haven Ranch. Right, Macy? Where are you going, Macy? Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, gosh, look. Wait. What the heck's going on here? Oh, my neighbor's dog is out. <laughs> Stop it. Hey! <laughs> Decide to leave, leave him, let him go for a little bit. Eat some different grass. Oh gosh. Uh -uh. Good thing we have a fence here. Oh, I don't want to be rude, but I don't want to abandon this live stream to go talk to my neighbors. You got an audience over there. <laughs> you have an audience. <laughs> They're bigger than my other dog already. It's crazy. Okay, somebody asked how I get them back into the paddock. I don't know. I'm going to try to do it with food later because they do, they really like their feed that I feed them. So I'm going to try to use that. Hopefully it works. Yeah. No, you don't shave them. Oh, the llamas? Oh, yeah, I got to shave them probably in a month. Yeah. They get real thick coats, kind of like sheep. Sorry, my neighbor is asking me a question. What's up, Sandra? What's up, Jonas? Love from Denmark. Hey, thank you, Justin. Hey, so I know it's been a little while since I've done a members-only live stream. And, oh, man, I feel so bad for a lot of y'all, you know, being members and, you know, being promised that I'll do, like, a live stream for y'all. And it's been a while. So following this live stream, I am going to jump on, you know, just... 
probably not as long as this live stream, but just like a little private one, just to kind of talk to it. Usually it's a very small live stream, you know, 20, 30 people are there. So I'm going to probably jump on that and yeah, what's up Hamlet? I think he's really upset that the animals are over, are over there with him or maybe he wants to come out. I don't know, but yeah, I am going to do a, like a private live stream for y'all for members only. So <clears throat> what's up rolling with me? So I went to the doctor today. Hey, what's up guys? What's up guys? Did you have fun saying what's up to the neighbors? Yeah. Oh, I'm so dirty. But yeah, got to do some tests and stuff. I've been getting like chest pains and stuff lately. And I think it's just from strenuous work here at the farm, lifting heavy stuff. Cause I'm pretty heart healthy. I did have a scare one time. It was, I don't know, sometime last year, I was getting some chest pains. And I thought for sure, like, hey, this dude's gonna have a heart attack or something. And I went in, I was perfectly fine. And they told me that it could just be like, you know, a pulled muscle or something. Cause I do, I mean, I, I don't work out all the time. I'm not like a, you know, a gym nerd or anything, but I do work out. And sometimes that can cause like some pains here and there. <sighs> Why are you guys so curious? I'm glad that they stay here with me. I mean, they're just right here. They're just really discovering all this land here. Might be a possibility that I can't get these guys back into their paddock, but it's gonna be fun trying. I mean, worst case, you know, they're they're still in my yard. I just hope that they don't ruin, cause like I have these great wooden fences in the front and in the back. However, on the sides, my big cow Mona, she could probably bend one of those fences and that's where she's kind of at right there. So I, I don't know how that's gonna work out. I mean, she can't jump over it, but if she feels threatened or she gets spooked, she could, I've seen her ruin fences really quick. Call the Omar mob to help you. <laughs> so yeah, I'm here alone right now. Uh, what's up? Hi, my name is Kristen. Love you, love you too. Uh, so I believe, um, I don't know how like to be, there should be like a join button. Like if you want to become a member, I know that it's a little weird with like iPhones. Uh, maybe there's, I don't know. I don't know exactly. There should be like a join button, but yeah, that's how you become a member. And it's, it's just like a way to, and I'm not just saying this like for me, but it's like your way to show your favorite creators like, Hey, and I'm a member to several channels. Like, Oh my God, look at these. This is so funny. They're climbing on that little, look at that. Oh my gosh. They're having so much fun. There's like a little mount, like a mountain of dirt or sand or whatever. And they're like climbing on it, the goats. Let's see if they do it again. I love, I love watching the animals like have fun and play, especially the goats. They're so much fun to watch. Hi guys. But look, is she going to do it again? Look. Oh, let's see if I can zoom in. This is so cute. Oh, Miss Piggy joined in the fun. Kat said, will you be doing another video with uh, Casey again? Uh, Casey and uh, like Mind Seed TV. Yeah, absolutely. We were actually talking about it later this month. So yeah, I love those guys. They're very creative, really, really fun to work with. That was so funny. Okay, see, I have ADHD really bad. Uh, let's get back to what I was talking about. And that is uh, supporting your favorite creators. I have several friends that are creators and I become members to them just to show my appreciation. Like, hey, you know, I want you to know that, uh, especially if you're like a self-funded channel, like myself, like all the videos that I put out, especially on Omar Gosh TV, I spend money to make these videos and they're 100% free. So being able to like be a member to your favorite channels on people that are spending money to make content religiously, like fun content, it's, uh, it's, it's just kind of your way to help out, you know, help their channel out. And, and sometimes that helps out with when we go on a trip and, uh, maybe we have a lot of gas, you know, gas is expensive, uh, hotel trips, things like that. So it does, it does kind of help a lot. It, it's not anything that we're like, you know, oh my gosh, like we're going to Vegas tonight, baby. We're going to go party. Uh, it, it's not like that. Uh, if, if I'm lucky, you know, maybe I could cover like a hotel room for a couple nights, you know, so that's kind of how that works, but it definitely helps. So, oh my, these guys are so cute. These guys are adorable, but look at these guys. They're just hopping and skipping and jumping. But yeah, just, you know, making entertainment, fun content, it's, it's not free. It's free to watch, but it's definitely, uh, it costs money to make. 
Uh, Lynn Harris, thank you so much. Hi, Omar, Tiffany, much love, respect from Lake Worth, Florida. Hey, I've never been to Lake Worth, Florida. We're actually supposed to be going to, I don't know the name of, we're going to a place I've never been to. It's only a couple hours away from this part of Florida that we're at. But yeah, I love, like Florida's so big and there's so many cool places to explore. And my birthday, if you didn't know, my birthday's coming up next week. So I wanted to get like just a little weekend getaway. Boss is supposed to be going with his dad and uh, for, I think for spring break or something. So he's gonna be gone and and it's uh, it's gonna be kind of nice to just relax for a couple of days. So something that we don't really get to do a whole lot of. And we're gonna leave our daughters here watching the farm. My son Max is gonna help out. What are you guys doing? You're getting into trouble, aren't you? You're getting into trouble. I could see it. Come here, Thelma. Hey, Louise, come here. Come here, Louise. Yeah, Tommy is get. He's getting neutered. He's trying to. He's trying to get my girls. You be. You be careful. I'm gonna put a diaper on that thing. Funniest thing ever. So we just broke Macy off of the bottle recently, and I. Occasionally, I will have a beer every once in a while. I'm not an alcoholic. I don't drink very often. I can get probably pretty drunk off one beer, just to give you an idea of how much I drink. But I think it was yesterday. I was drinking like a bottle, like a beer, just one beer. And Macy thinks it's a bottle for her to drink. She's like, she was just like all over me. I had to like, I had to throw the beer out because she was like attacking me with, hey, don't go in there. Oh, look at her. He was trying to get my girl right now. Hey, no, don't do that. Don't you dare. Oh my gosh. I do not need any pregnant baby goats right now. Stop it. Okay, I need to do something. Come on, get away, go. You guys have all this grass to eat. Why are you hanging out here? Go. It's messy here. It's because I'm here, that's what it is. Okay, Ugh, I'm back. Oh, it got a little cold outside. Hmm. Oh, what's up, Mary? Hey, Valerie. <laughs> Where are they at? Why'd you guys go back? Come on. All right, you know what it is? It's because they want to hang out with me. Come on, let's go over here. <laughs> the way she runs is so goofy. Look at this. These guys are the best. Hi, Macy. You want to give me a kiss? Oh my gosh, Mona is eating the tree. Oh, this is kind of cool. This one thing I love about this property is even though I have nine acres of land, I only have three trees. I love trees. Don't get me wrong. I love trees, but I love the open land. Like this is amazing. It looks like a big pasture. And I think that's what this used to be back in the day. It was like a big cow pasture. How you doing? Hey, Mona. Don't step on anybody. Why are they going over there? Stay away from the construction. Okay, she's got to get some hill action too. Oh, what the heck is she doing? She's getting dirty. Look at this. <laughs> what the heck? It's so funny. Hey, thanks, Ty Tyree. Hey, Sandra. Does that taste good, guys? I think it's going to be really hard to get these guys out. I don't think this is happening. I don't think this is happening. Oh no, what she's chewing on something. Gracie girl is my chewer. She be chew. What is that? No, stop it. Give me that. No, 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 no. Give me. Gracie, good girl. What the heck? Oh dang, somebody's starting a fire. Tyree, my bad. Wait, that's it. I, I, it's these comments go by so fast, and I can't scroll back down on them, so I only see them for a sec. So, what the heck? Come on. All right. Sorry, I can't 
read that one super chat that's up above. What's up, Esperanza? Yeah, comments are... <laughs> the way the goats hop around is so funny. Look at them. They're just having a good old time. No! Found another one? Okay. Good girl, Gracie. Oh. So you know anything about construction workers, they can be a little messy. We do have this giant, you know, dumpster. Maybe we'll go dumpster diving later. No, I'm just kidding. No dumpster diving there. And they still, they just, they just throw their trash on the ground. I think I picked up a Jersey Mike's sub thing. Oh my gosh, don't go over there. Well, Tom's trying to go in this hole. That's my septic tank. All right, good times. But yeah, construction zone. It's uh, it's working out. I'm not gonna be able to get them back. I think my animals are gone for good. Bye. Have a nice life. Oh, definitely gonna need some help. Let me know if you're in the area. You want to help me round round up, round up these animals. Here goes some more, more trash. I don't even drink Mountain Dew. What the heck? Why do you guys want to hang out there? Just don't do any dookies. And no making this a bedroom. No. Okay, I'm going to put this in here. All right. Guys. Oh, I know. I know why they like it so much. They're seeing their reflections right there. They're like, more goats. Is that what it is? You like seeing your reflection, huh? <laughs> They're so cute. Just don't go in the house. No. Where are you going? All right, this should be fun. Ugh. I don't know how I'm gonna get them back there. What's going on? Hey, hi. You gonna help me get the big animals in? Yeah. We had a scare with Dak. It was like a week and a half ago. He uh, got stepped on by my cow. And he was okay though. But he's always like getting stepped on. I think I've seen the llama step on him. Like he's just always in the way. How you doing, buddy? How you doing? <laughs> hey, thank you for becoming a member. And thank you, Brenna. Brenna? I couldn't read your comment there. It says, how's it going? Love your videos. Much love from Manitoba. Hey, Canada. That's what's up. I was just in Canada a couple weeks ago. <clears throat> My neighbors are like me. Love being outside. Hey, thank you. Somebody said something about, you know, having a big heart and stuff like that. I feel like everybody here has a big heart because y'all love animals. If you love animals, you're my type of people. And Joel, thank you so much for becoming a member. And man, I'm trying to read a couple of these. Let me just uh, take this off here. All right, I think now I can click on stuff. Okay, Raptor Adventures, what's up? I miss you guys too. Joel, thank you. And it says, uh, okay, Brenna, okay, sorry. I think I got your name right. All right, my phone isn't very touch friendly. I don't know, it's not working very well. What's up, Antonia? What's up, Sonia? Hey, Hank. <clears throat> hey, Ocha Papocho, Antonio, Antonia, sorry, Antonia said. Mo and Shadia is having another baby. It's a girl. <gasps> no way. They're having, a, they're having another baby? It's a girl. Oh, I'm just playing. I already knew. I already knew that. Mo's like my best friend right now. Well, ever. Like, he's always been my best friend. Well, one of my best friends. I got a couple best friends. You know, let me know in the comments. You have more than one best friend. I got got plenty of, like, like Mo's like a brother to me. James like a brother. Like, my boy Jody. Like, I just have a lot of great friends. And they're like family to me. Elizabeth, thank you for being a member that long, man. That's awesome. Who would you... Wait, what? Who would you love to do a video with? And who wouldn't you want to do a video with? Um... I don't know if I, I, I don't want to answer that. I mean, as far as like, who do I not want to do a video with? I will say this, okay? Um, yes, there are people that I wouldn't do videos with. 
And when it comes to people that are, um, people that are selfish, people that aren't friendly, people that don't love animals, those are the people that I would not make videos with. As far as wanting to make videos with people, I mean, just, it, I, I love making videos with the people that I know and trust, you know, so that's kind of, that's kind of where I'm at. Steven, thank you for becoming a member. I appreciate that, man. And Michelle, thank you too. She, she, Ann and Lily. I don't know if I said your last name right, but thank you for that super sticker. That's really, really nice of you. What are you doing, Louise? I caught Louise doing some humping the other day too. Macy, why are you eating like rock grass right now? Like, oh my gosh, look at great. That's a uh, Dixie right there. She's just having so much fun in that sand. Oh my gosh. They're having a good time. I have to say. Having a good time. And Gracie found something else to chew on over there. She's just having a good time. Does that taste good? Yeah. Is it yummy? How is Cookie? Cookie is doing okay. I did um, talk about Cookie earlier, but she's doing good. She's doing as good as she can be being 16 years old. She'll be 17 in June. I hope she makes it to 17. I was thinking today, all right, look, so my son Max is, he'll be 20 this year. Like he's 19 years old. And I got Cookie when Cookie, well, I got Cookie in 2006. Max was two years old. And he's going to be 20 this year. Just to give you an idea of how long Cookie's been around. I mean, she's been around so long. She was around when I was living in upstate New York, which is, like that was a long time ago. I moved back here to Florida in 2009. If you didn't know, I lived in, well, Western New York, not upstate New York. I lived in Western New York, uh, right outside of Buffalo for about five, about four to five years. And that's where I have, we have a second home there that we go occasionally and go visit. And uh, actually I was thinking about going back again recently. What do you have? Oh my gosh. These dogs are driving me crazy. I can't wait till, I mean, I love them as puppies because they're cute, but they're just like way too playful and they just get into everything. Gracie, Gracie, what is that? No, Gracie. Oh my gosh. Hey, Dim Dimitar, I'm doing really good. Thank you so much for, for asking about that. Uh, Crystal, thank you for becoming a member. And I think I mentioned Steven. Oh my gosh, what is she doing? Gracie, stop it. Okay, okay, Dak, I love you to death, but I don't want your dirty cuddles right now. Maybe in a little bit. Uh, Roy, hey, thank you so much for that super sticker, bro. Appreciate that. Very, very nice of you. Uh, I don't know why, but my touch response is not working very well so if you sent me like a super chat or something like that i can't like i can't read it and i am so sorry like the ones that i can read um thank you and even if i can't read thank you too because i really appreciate that okay there was one from jamie jamie thank you so much for it was a, a 20 dollars super chat thank you for that um hope you're doing haunted videos with twin paranormal i love twin paranormal some of my favorite dudes right there Eventually, eventually I'll get back up to Nevada and make some video. I do got an awesome video and I am going to post an update hopefully soon about uh, the whole like, oh gosh, it's been, it's been a, a, been a work in progress. I did hire an extra editor, like outsourced one to help me out with the big project. Now Miss Piggy got something in her mouth, but yeah, I have about seven. Oh my gosh. What, what are these guys doing? Oh no. But I have like seven more videos to edit before I can start releasing the big project that I have. If you didn't know, back in October, November, I did filming with 16 different creators and Twin Paranormal is one of them. And he actually did a video recently. He was like, release the footage, the Twin Paranormal footage. And I had a lot of people like hitting me up. Like if, and I wish he had explained it a little bit better. And I actually messaged him after like, hey man, like what did you say in your video? Cause I got all these people messaging me thinking that I'm just like holding on, like being a jerk and holding on to your footage. And um, he didn't mean to, I mean, he was just like I, being funny about it. But I have 16 videos that I have to edit. And then after I'm done editing all 16 of those videos, I have to chop them up and it's gonna be so cool. But it's definitely gonna be worth the wait, but I, I like, I feel like in every video, every social post, I always get like a couple people ask like, hey, when is that coming out? 
unfortunately, like I had to kind of take that project on myself. I had an editor, two editors that were helping me and they kind of fell through. They weren't able to help me like I wanted them to help me. And I got stuck doing everything myself. So what are you doing? Okay, I thought one of these guys was choking or something. Hey, don't break my glass. Hey, stop it. She's trying to fight herself. Hey, no, stop that. No. No, look, she's trying to fight herself. Why are you being, you are so dumb. Okay, hey, no, no, no. Stop fighting yourself. Hey, Louise. They're just gonna fight you back. Hey, they're just gonna fight you back. Go, go play, go play, go eat some grass. Okay, sorry about that. Yeah, that's funny. But uh, yeah, um, as far as like the, you know, the series and stuff, like I just, I have a lot of work. The only, only way I would be able to like realistically finish everything, I would have to stop uploading videos. And that's the thing is I still have to upload here. I have, I have to upload on my other channel, Oh My Gosh TV, I still have to film videos. So it's a, it's a lot of work. And to be able to find extra time to edit, yeah, it's, it's gonna be uh, nearly impossible. So I'm, I'm working on it. So that's gonna be uh, something that it'd definitely be worth the wait. So, hey, thank you so much, Roy. Again, you're the best. You're the best too, man, thank you. And thank you, Jackie, for becoming a member. Uh, tech girl thank you again thanks for being you love to tiff we're off to sleep have a good evening hey where are you guys at hey stop fighting the window oh my gosh these guys are pissing me off look at this like fighting herself louise you're gonna break my window stop it no hey stop it go okay I gotta try to get these guys inside their area. I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. All right, you guys want some food? Want some food? That was so funny. What's up, cop humor? Lynn, thank you. My horse and kitchen screen door history. I don't know what that meant, but thank you for the super chat. She's gonna crack that. I hope not. That was so funny. Come on, guys, let's go eat. Come on. Hey, Jessica's no, thank you. You guys ready? Want some food? Okay, oh look. Okay, might get lucky. They're kind of following me right now. Come on, guys. You know what sucks? Is uh, it's getting dark, first of all. But uh, I have their food all the way in that barn now. Like that's where their food's at. Guys, come on. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. This is going to be so hard. Should have never did this. I mean, at least these guys are coming along. They just play. I like to play. Let me know here in the comments if you know how much my dogs weigh already. Because they're gaining weight and getting big, like, by the day. Put it this way. One of them, when we, we had her at the vet, or him at the vet, within one week gain 10 pounds okay some of them are coming got the goats coming come on guys they know what time it is they know what time it is i mean honestly even if the cows don't make it like they're fine got mona mona f up a coyote like she's big and even my my like medium-sized cow lily She's pretty savage, too. All right, all right, all right. Okay, they're kind of coming. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Come on. I mean, if I could get the little guys in, that's that's who I want because I don't want them getting attacked in the middle of the night. They got to get locked up. I mean, they're kind of flirting with the fence there. Are they going to come? Maybe not, maybe so. Come on, guys. Okay. Macy is off to the other side. What are you guys doing? All right. All right. Come on. You guys hungry? 
<laughs> Omar, when are you and Tiff getting married? I don't know. Ask Tiffany. We don't have a date. No date yet. Hey, thank Wishy. You love your content. Keep up the good work. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Appreciate that. Hey, what's up, Kyle? How is lunch and cookie? Cookie's doing really good. And thank you, Roy. Thank you again. Omar, been to Texas yet? Yes, I have been to Texas. Twice been to Texas. Actually, no, I'm lying. I've been to Texas three times. And one of my episodes from Alone in the Dark 2, which is featuring 16 different creators, is at the Yorktown Hospital with CJ. Oh, gosh. It's pretty dark over here. Can I turn the light on or something? Oh, sorry if it's dark. Come on, guys. Got food for you. So I got a bunch of feed in here. Oh, you can't see nothing. Can't see nothing. All right. Come on, guys. I know Mona's gonna come. Guys, no, no, get out, 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 out. Come on, out, out, out. Come on, out, out, Dak. Come on, let's get out. Come on, come on, out, Dak, out. Tiffany, I could sure use your help right now. All right, hey, you're gonna get locked in there. You guys hungry? You guys hungry? It's so dark. All right, we got the goats in there. Oh, wow. This is my new barn, by the way. Coming in pretty good. I do got the goats in here. Here's Macy. She's eating a little bit of food. Here, I'm going to leave that down here. You could eat that. All right, I did lock up Dak in here because he was being a jerk. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. No, out. Out. Okay. Oh my gosh. These guys are having a ball. All right. Okay. I am going to need the bigger animals in here eventually, though. This is getting a little dark out. Wow. It looks like it's real dark out. But at least I got the little ones in. Stay. 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 You guys hungry? Come on. Let's eat. Come on. You guys hungry? I got their dog food in here. Let's see how my pasture looks. No big cow poopies. Because I pick them up. Well, technically I don't pick them up. Oh, we got some light. Very nice. But yeah, I like to keep these guys nice and clean. Takes a little work. Here. Yummy, yummy, yummy. All right. Here you go, Dak. I mean, Gracie, sorry. You guys look alike. Would you get your dogs mixed up if they look like that? You can only tell Gracie, like, she has, like, some dark around her. Hi, my name is Kristen. Hey, thank you for becoming a member. And thank you, Chrissy, too. Where is your Alone series? Wait. Where is my Alone series? It's <laughs> it's being edited by itself, by AI. Oh my gosh, that'd be so cool. I would pay thousands for that. But unfortunately, yeah, I'm still working on it. But I do have an Alone series that I did by myself. I figured it would be way more interesting to have 16 other creators. Well, 15, and I'm in it too. And going back and forth from each one to be way more interesting. Hi, baby. You guys stay in here, okay? Anywho, could use some of this lighting. All right. That was stressful, but it worked. Big animals are still out there. I don't know how I'm going to get them in, but it should be kind of fun in a little bit. Hey, good night to you, Barbara. Rebecca. Defo need a light. 
down in the barn. Yeah, for sure. Yep. We need some light. I mean, even if it's just some, like, like this is solar lighting right here, and it works pretty good. It's not bad. I mean, it gets really dark back here. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> mm -hmm. uh, Minnesota Rebel, I am not on Instagram anymore. I'm sorry. But big shout out to you, and uh, I'll, maybe I'll come back to Instagram or Twitter. But, yeah, I, at the beginning of this video, I kind of mentioned that I'm not on social media much anymore other than youtube i will be on youtube but i don't know youtube is not really i don't know it's not really social media to me like yeah it's not but whatever happened to raven 2 i don't know what that means i never had a raven 2 oh gosh come on i need some light again all right okay there we go Hey, thank you, Chrissy Bear. I have been watching all your videos since when you started, and I always enjoy your content. Hey, thank you so much. Appreciate it. You know, there's it's nothing worse than, like, I mean, not that it's worse. I, I, I'm, it's still cool, but um, lately... <coughs> hey, stop it. You already had your food. But, like, sometimes I'll meet people in public, and they'll be like, Hey, Omar, like, I used to watch your videos. And I'm like, you know, I still make videos, right? Like, and I'll, I'll often ask them too. I'm like, you know, so why did you stop watching my videos? You know, what's going on? And I mean, some of them, like, you know, like some of them are kids. They maybe grew out of like watching like scary videos or whatnot. But wow, it's getting dark out here. But uh, yeah, if you ever see like us creators in public, don't ever come up to them and say, I used to watch your videos. Cause it's like, it's a, uh, it's depressing. I mean, not that depression is an emotion, because it's not, but uh, it's sometimes, you know, we put a lot of heart and soul into, like, our content, and uh, it's, you know, we see people come and go. It's, it's you know, it's the internet, you know? Of course, uh, you get a lot of new people, and it's great, but sometimes, sometimes it's sad. It's sad to, like, see some people, like, you know, not watch your content anymore. Maybe they're not getting recommended your content much anymore, or, or whatnot, but yeah, man, I used to watch videos. No, watch my videos now. What's up, Mel? Love you. And there's a lot of you here in the comments have been watching my videos for years, and I'm truly grateful for that. Like, I hope I get to meet some of you guys here in public, you know, wherever you're at in the world. Do do a lot of traveling. So, and yes, you always are, Kelsey York. Love you. Uh, I'm changing my contact around. Hey, it's Jenna from VT. Do you have... Oh my gosh, I just missed that comment. I can't read these comments. Stop. I wish YouTube would allow you to click on a comment and be able to, like, save them. Uh, Boston is with his mom right now. Actually, I think they're at, no, they're at um, practice because he's uh, he plays football. So I had to stay here, hold down the fort. But anyways, look, I did promise some members, and I'm going to be going live, doing exclusive live stream, just, you know, something kind of exclusive and fun, and, and maybe I'll try to get some of these animals the bigger animals in, but, um, I do appreciate y'all, you know, being here with me, and I appreciate all the su support, the love, especially for my dog, Cookie, thank you, Miss Diva, you should go on Twitch, I've never been on Twitch, that should be fun, what are you doing, what are you doing, Dak, Dak is so lovable, he's my lovable dog, I mean, Gracie's lovable too, but not like Dak, Dak's just like, he's a ham, Gracie, come here, come here, come here, Gracie, see, she don't come up like, like Dak comes that's why Dak's always getting stepped on. He's always, like, hanging out with all the animals. But, uh, I've been watching. My mom, Patsy. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, but I, I wish I could click on these comments and make them freeze, but they won't. Like, I'll click on one, and then it just more come. So, it's kind of hard for me to, to read the comments. But, anyways, yeah. Um, I haven't been live here in a while. I do plan on going live a lot more on my other channel, Oh My Gosh Live. If you're not subscribed there, make sure to go there. I do... I did a lot more live streams there, but I am going to probably be doing a lot more once I get this series out of the way and I'm able to have a little bit more time. Uh, time is something that is definitely a commodity for me, something that's, uh, uh, what, that commodity is not the word. Um, it's uh, having a brain fart here. Uh, it's just something that doesn't come so easy. Uh, like I, I don't get much time to sleep as it is and being on the farm already being a busy person is uh it's just extra but uh yeah once i get these guys a little bit bigger and they're a little bit more independent that's it's gonna be so much easier it's gonna be easier to travel easier to to do more like live streams and stuff but um 
Luxury. Yeah, it's a luxury. Thank you, Tiffany, for that. Uh, when is your next video? When is your next video idea? Kyle said. I have ideas every single day for videos. Uh, I do have a video that's probably going to be released tomorrow on Omar Gosh TV. So, yeah, I'm going to be putting that up. So I might have a premiere for it. So if you're going to be there, you know, check it out. Macy says goodbye. And thanks for being live with us. Sorry it's getting dark here. I would stay live a little bit longer. But, yeah, yeah, that's my time right there. But, anyways, got to go for now before we leave. Give me a kiss. Peace. I'll see you guys.